Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can cheat in the game Baldur's Gate 3 using Cheat Engine. First things first, you're going to need to download Cheat Engine. You get it from cheatengine.org. I'll put a link for that in the description. And second, you're going to need the cheat table, which is the file that you open with Cheat Engine. And you get it from this forum page here. I'll put a link for this as well. So we're gonna load up our game. We're gonna launch Cheat Engine and you click this little computer monitor icon, select Baldur's Gate from the list of processes that are open and click open and then click this little folder open icon and select BG3, which is the cheat table that we just downloaded. It might take a moment to load, but once it does, this is what it looks like. We're gonna go ahead and load into our game. And now that we're loaded in, we can start using some cheats. One of the options you have here, it's called console commands. And you just check this little white box and it makes a sub menu come up. And there's another sub menu here called register commands. We'll click that box. And that's gonna load all these cheats here through the console commands. Now there are a lot of cheats here to go through, but we'll just go through some of the most basic ones that you can get started with and then you can play around with the rest in your own time. For some really simple cheats, you can go to the on-demand cheats and this has stuff like reset cooldowns, add 100 gold, add 100 XP and these work by clicking this checkbox over and over. You can just keep giving yourself XP, you can keep giving yourself gold. See here I have 5,000 gold, I'll just keep clicking this button and now I have 14,000. You can transform yourself into a mind flayer and back. A little bit down the list here is one console submenu called random cheats. And here you can do something like add 50 to your max health. So you see I have 132 max health. If I keep clicking it, it's just gonna go up really high. Same goes for armor rating, max all your stats. So you have 20 to all your stats. You can turn on God mode so you can't get killed. And this works by selecting the character you want to do this on and then doing the cheats. So these console commands will only work on the character you have selected. One cheat that I found is really fun is the movement cheats. So you can just turn on super jump, unlimited movement, no fall damage. And this just lets you traverse the map really easily. Makes you feel like Superman. And one cheat I think you really need to know about is the item spawner. And that opens up a sub menu for you. And at the bottom here, there's two sub menus called various consumables and various gear sets. So if you just click this, it'll spawn a pouch underneath you. I find that this is a little bit glitchy. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But you can see here, I've gotten all kinds of scrolls and consumables from using that option. But if you want to spawn a very specific item, you'll want to go to one of these pre-made templates here. So like spawn hand crossbow plus two sample script. You're gonna double click here where it says script and it's gonna open up this window here. This value here where it says local item equals and then this alphanumeric license key looking value here. This is the ID for the item. On this same forum page where you downloaded this cheat, there is an item ID list here. And you can just go and click see original. And this will have the item ID for any item that you want. So like here, this says Hellbore Tusk. We're gonna copy the value from that. And we're gonna switch it out for this value and click okay. And now when we press this checkbox, it spawns that item. Item received, Hellbore Tusk. And you can do that with any item here. So that's how you can set up Cheat Engine to work with Baldur's Gate 3. I hope this video helped you. If it did, remember to give it a thumbs up and have fun. And I'll see you in another video.